ATS Corporation's Albuquerque, New Mexico location is a 97,000 square foot ISO certified facility for the production of polycrystalline piezoelectric materials and RF ceramic components. In this facility, raw materials get weighed and wet mixed. The slurry then gets filter pressed to remove excess water, followed by drying and calcining. Ball milling of the powder provides desired particle size. Spray drying of the powder helps achieve a flowable form, which enables a higher press density of the material. Pressing of the powder into its desired shape can be achieved by uniaxial or isopressing. During this process, exceptionally high pressure is used to create a densely pressed, near nut-shaped product. Continuous kilns are used to sintered press forms and carefully engineered sintered temperatures. Post-firing quality control and processing of the components is necessary to achieve desired properties. Sintered blocks get sliced into wafers using a variety of proprietary techniques. Sliced wafers get lapped into desired thicknesses using high volume lapping equipment. Electrodes can also be applied using thick film or thin film techniques. Electrical and mechanical testing is an important part of ensuring quality. Dimensional accuracy, electrical properties, and surface properties are only a few of the quality measures monitored. CTS's Albuquerque facility maintains a Class 10,000 clean room for piezoelectric components, which require chemical etching. In this process, a layer of material which resists chemical etching is deposited onto the surface of the piezoelectric component. This enables selective etching of the material. Once the etching process is complete, the deposited layer is clean from the finished product. CTS employs several high-precision dicing machines in order to cut the wafer into individual components. Once processing is complete, each component undergoes a rigid routine of visual and automated inspections to ensure quality. Packaging is then completed in a clean room environment to prevent contamination of the finished wafer. For more information, visit www.ctscorp.com.